watching Carlisle's Picks. So we just tested out the new Yamaha FZ6. And I gotta say, it's pretty impressed with the bike overall. The way the handlebars are, it's much more comfortable than on the, on the race bikes where you, you kind of really lean forward in a really aggressive position. Not so good for your back, not so good for your wrist, especially the older R6s. I don't know how the new R6 is, but I know the older R6, very uncomfortable on the wrist because of the handlebar position and everything. Um, not a problem on this bike, very comfortable on the wrist, very comfortable seating position. Brakes are powerful enough Certainly not as aggressive as what you could expect on a race bike. The transmission is very smooth, power delivery is very smooth. It, it has a decent amount of power, especially in the city. However, on the highway, it's not quite as crazy as an R6. As a matter of fact, there's a significant difference in the power on the highway versus an R6. So the Yamaha FZ6 is essentially the R6 for the real world. The R6 is designed to win races. <laughs> Everything is about performance. So that bike will definitely sacrifice your comfort in the name of performance. However, this bike is a bike that definitely performs, although not on the same level of the R6, because those compromises that are made on the R6 to win are removed from this bike. So much more comfortable riding position. The power is not as crazy. It doesn't rev as high. So it's much more tame compared to the R6. I mean, you can do four, five, six hours on this bike. So if you're a sports bike minded person and you might just go on a racetrack once in a while, but you want something that you can actually go long distances and be comfortable on a bike like this, and then this is absolutely, I think, uh, a great bike for you in that sense. The only problem I have with this bike is for people like me who aren't looking for a bike like that, we're certainly gonna miss the power that the R6 has. Now, this bike is aggressive in the city in terms of, you know, you're doing 25, 30 miles per hour. In first gear, it can pull fairly aggressively, but on a highway, you're just not gonna get that. That, you're gonna need an R6 to get kind of those high-speed aggressive pulls. So that's the basic idea. If that's the kind of bike you're looking for, a much more realistic, real world type of bike, which definitely you can do four, five, six hours on and then pull over to a nice country road and just lean, 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 and come back without your aching wrist like on the old R6, then you found your bike, the Yamaha FZ6.